Welcome back to Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. We're marauded on this island. Let's go explore it. Who do we- And there's a star piece! Oh, wow. Who do we get rid of first? My money's on Flavio. But uh, here's what I understand. They're charging me to rest. <laughs> it's like, we are miles away from civilization. And yet you're going to charge me? I cannot escape capitalism! Toad girl's got to make her money. <sighs> Wait, was she, was she even on our original crew? Oh, I've been here for three. I've been here for three years already. Wait a minute. So you're saying there's there's actual civilization around here? What? Ah! Ah! No, fuzzies! I hate them. Great. Okay. Uh, I'll start with the quake hammer to wake everybody up. Wow, oh, that wasn't enough. Of Jesus. What are we doing with Goombella? I can't see them. It's a fuzzy, and it's green. Duh. Uh, five. Oh. Wow. Five? That ain't bad. The attack is uh, something to worry about a little bit. Eee! <laughs> they got some mad suck going. Don't let them catch you. Hey, don't kink shame Goombella. What if I like that? What if I'm in to have my blood sucked? But it's your blood. Oh, right, and they multiply. Shit. Right. Shit. Ah. Oh, I hear the I hear them boinging. Oh, wait a minute. Fortunately, when uh, when I uh, when they multiply, their health doesn't restart. Doesn't yeah. Restart. That's actually cool. Oh god. Oh, that was close. Uh, you know that that has happened the least amount out of all the bingos. I can't even remember what it does. Something bad, I'm sure. Can Has the it even... fog go away? There Thank we you. Go. Has it even happened yet? Uh, not yet. Okay. And I hope it doesn't. It's just an automatic game over. <laughs> oh, and wouldn't it be wonderful if it happened during a really hard fight? We're getting really close to leveling up. That's nice. Head rattle! Whoa! Con confuse enemies. Doesn't help me right now. Oh! And a courage shell! Koopy Koo, we found you! Oh god, not like this! No! Koops is like, who was it? I think I know them. <laughs> the next the next box we open has a skeleton in it. Wow, you found a dry bones! Uh with no and shell. Grandpa? No, no! Oh, there's a there's a pink one now. Great. I don't like that. What's it do? Let's see. It multiplies by five every turn. Huh? It's the same as a green fuzzy, but it takes flower points. Ew! Oh, that's worse. Yeah. We need that. Yeah, I need that. And when it gets enough, it'll it'll do its own magical attacks. Oh. Uh oh. Kill it quickly. Oh, Goom oh Goombella, you got so much sass. Sassy bitch. All right, let's uh, kill this thing as uh, now as possible. There we go. Nah, that's not too bad. Oh. Ah. Oh! One off. One more. <laughs> Give me that level up. Oh, oh, great! Prison piranha, piranha! Ooh, uh oh. Aha! Oh, good job. Alright, where to start? Uh, first, I think I'll take this guy out. Excellent. What do we call those? Patui piranhas? Or poison piranhas? Putrid, Putrid piranhas. piranhas! Ooh. Another 830. But it can also inflict poison upon us. I Aha. love poison statuses in games. Especially in, in Pokemon when uh, Pokemon uses toxic. Badly poisoned is a great status effect, but not when it's used against you. 
Oh, you poison people? I just punch them in the face hard enough. I mean, it works out. You can't poison me if you're dead! You know, when you have a Garboder going up against a really powerful Pokemon, and you just inflict it with Toxic, and it takes its sweet time dying as you just revel in the fact that it's squirming and dying slowly. It just feels amazing. Or I could use Mega Punch and break their face and watch as the, you know, poor little five-year-old has to sweep up the remains of their Pidgey. Uh, okay, look, look, Garboder's a big sack of hit points and he can take a lot of hits, so there's a lot of healing going on as I wait for the final boss to just, you know, slowly kill itself. <laughs> Stalling is what we call it. And we leveled up! Yay! FP is gonna be a problem, I can tell, so let's upgrade that. What do you say? Thank you! I know you've probably already mentioned this, but does BP stand for brownie points? <laughs> it stands for batch points. Uh, oh, what? Oh! Hey. Invisible coin block! Hey, hey, hey! Oh my god, that's a thing? It's crucial, actually, and you'll find out why later. Ooh, platforming. Okay. Yeah, you're not, not using that ice storm on me, no way. <laughs> I, I need to ask, how much Mario Maker 2 have you played? Quite a bit, why? I, I'm just remembering, there was actually a level that I played that said, there is one hidden coin block here. I found it and died. <laughs> I got, I got a couple of fun ideas. Uh, one I'm working on right now is called Find the Dev Exit. Ooh, that would you, be interesting. You gotta find secret, hidden, tricky uh, yeah. exits out of the level. But I've also got one called 1-1, one, one, but... <laughs> it's, ju it's just 1-1, one, one, but uh, at the very end, there's it's covered in invisible coin blocks, making it impossible for you to hit, to hit the goal. Oh dear. You gotta, you gotta find a hidden path somewhere, which takes you down to a secret pipe behind the flagpole, which you use then to win the level. Interesting. Well, uh, don't give away everything, you insane person. Well, I didn't say where it was. Well, that's a good point. I'm just really bad at making levels. Like, I'll gladly play levels until I'm blue in the face, but I'm just bad at making them. See, my way of making levels is that, you know, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, I, I've got this clever idea, but then I see somebody else's level, and I'm like, damn, that's a good idea! Why didn't I think of that? Oh! <laughs> it's a shame that Mario Maker 2 is done getting extra content, because I would have loved to have seen, if they were given more time and development, what they, what more could they do? Yeah, and they said there wouldn't be any more Splatfests. Well, all right. That's because Splatoon 2 came out. <laughs> Unless you're talking about... Oh, wow, another star piece. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, I was right. Platforming. Time to platform. And... Okay, I can't use Yoshi for that. I gotta actually jump. But can Great. I clear it? Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah. <laughs> ah! Ah... That's why we needed that coin. Oh. Mm -hmm. I, need, I need that, thank you. Hey, hey! Nice. Hey, a Thunder Rage! I can't carry anything else. You know, let's finally get rid of this dried shroom. Stinking up my pockets. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, I think I want to make... Mario Maker puzzle puzzle levels, just like one room puzzles. Maybe that's what I need to go for. Oh, hi guys! Where have you been the past three days? Stuck on the bridge next to flames. Oh, Admiral, you're a brave, brave soul. Oh, please tell me that Bobbery becomes a party member and he just explodes. That'd be kind of neat. Yeah, that would be kind of neat, wouldn't it? I love how he's doing, like, quick dodges. Well, we got two out of the three crew members, so that's good. They're gonna head back.
and uh, wink to camera. What? <laughs> okay, that's pretty nice. <laughs> All right, I'll be a good sport about it then. <laughs> the game literally, the game seriously just went, yeah, yeah, we know, you know, I know, you know, he don't know. And then Yoshi out here reassembling the fourth wall. What the fuck is he talking about? Another shine sprite! These things are everywhere, jeez. Well, yeah, we're in the tropical setting where shine sprites love to breed, dude. Gotta get down there somehow. And there you go. That is so clever. Ice that, power. That would have taken me forever. Like, I would have tried to, like, jump off the side. It would have been like, oh, I probably have to come back here later. Nope. Oh, no. He's in trouble! Bobbery, no! We have so oh! many shanties! Alright, let's take on some more ghosts. You know, this battle theme kind of reminds me of fighting a boss in Yoshi's Island. Well, I can't jump on them, but can I gulp them? Yoshi's can eat fire. Yes, he can. Oh my God, Yoshi, you are proving ah! your you are proving your worth. Oh, oh God, my dude, come on! I know you can do it. Hammer, so I guess I'll just try this. There we go. That was beautiful. <laughs> All right, Yoshi. But Eat can fire. I ground pound? Uh, Probably not, because it's fire and predictable. New. Yep. <laughs> Great. <laughs> ah. <laughs> hey, what? those fucking rocks down! <laughs> I didn't even notice it. God, the crowd would love me because I would never be able to find people throwing rocks and it'd just be like a free for all. <laughs> hey, who did that? Who did that? Was it you? Hey! Bobbery? No! Oh, wait, he's okay. Oh, Bobbery. Oh, no. We're too yeah. late. No. That's not right. Chocola Cola? No, we're nowhere near Bean Bean Kingdom. You know, I have a Coca Cola right here. You know, that's saying, you know. Mm. Some people have a Coke or a Pepsi household, or a Coke household. Well, he needs his cola before he dies, and, you know, frankly, if I'm on my deathbed, <laughs> I, too, would love the crisp, refreshing taste of Coca-Cola. We need to get back there somehow. There's gotta be a way to get to that pipe, and... No! That ain't it. Okay, oh, that actually only... does take health. I didn't... Oh, <laughs> yes, it does. Didn't even put two mm. and two together. Oh, look at that! Ah. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Ah. <laughs> okay. Oh god! Let's just focus <laughs> up here. Calm, careful, cool, oh collected. Oh god! <laughs> it's too funny. There we go. Oh hey! A coconut. Let's Enjoy get... your coconut. Let's toss out this uh, slow shroom. And another coconut. We're gonna get rid of now. Uh, how about a shooting star? Yeah, confusion doesn't really help me too much. No, I don't need the. I don't want it. Get rid of it. All right. That was just for two coconuts. I wish our inventory was just a little bit bigger, and nope! I gotta be oh, careful, I'm gonna no. die. Please don't die. I don't- I don't wanna die either. 
I'd prefer not to die. It would be very much appreciated. Hey, an in coupon! What to oh, get cool. rid of now? How about a courage shell? Never use that. Wait, don't we? Do we have to use those coconuts? No. Ah! <sighs> oh, great. Um. All right. Uh. Please use an item. Please I use an idea. item. Art attack. The new the new power we got at the end of the last chapter. Check this out. So you gotta draw a circle. It's very generous on what circle means. Oh, wow. This is awesome! Yeah, it is! Look how much gosh dang damage you're doing! That's why it's four star powers. Holy god! Woohoo! Yeah. Cool! Alright, let's. Just make our way back to town so we don't die. Excuse me, can you save Excuse me? me I, have, ah! uh, I have a coupon though! No! Um, okay. Use an item. Uh, Please use an item. Okay. Please use an item. Okay, so. Because oh you're you. gonna do, Yoshi. You're gonna gulp up. Like that. There you go. Takes care of him. But Mario, what you're gonna do is, uh, you're uh, gonna jump on this guy back here. So that way, there's no way you can lose any health for the next turn. Just flower power. Phew. Alright. Now finish him off! Bonk! Bonk! See, that's how you strategize when you have sweat dripping down your forehead and your hands start to shake and your breathing gets erratic. No death. No death. You get you get no, heart palpitations. Oh, he's and coming right at you! No, you just start crying for no reason. <laughs> we made <laughs> it. Mario comes running back, tears in his eyes. The fuzzies are gonna get me. So we'll stay, but we have a we have a coupon. Oh, hey, wait a minute. We haven't seen like the fuzzy fuzzies. Hmm. How about police fuzzes? The fuzz fuzzies. I don't know, we haven't met the psychedelic fuzzies. Maybe we see one fuzzy that goes waka waka. Fuzzy bear. <laughs> yes, I saw the star piece, I forgot about it, I know it's there, we'll get it. <laughs> I was about to say. Still missing Bobbery, and uh, hey, have you seen any? Have you guys seen any Coca Cola around here? This episode is sponsored by Coca Cola. Actually, it's sponsored by Pepsi, but you know, whatever. It's sponsored by Mountain Dew. How many other so brands Pepsi, can we get angry? So Pepsi is the drink of life. You drink it when you're alive. Coca Cola is the drink of death. You drink it when you're about to die. It just helps you on. It clogs the arteries. Look at all that sugar. <gasps> So Edward's gonna die. He needs the Coca-Cola. Chicoca Cola Coca-Cola. Well, Chicola Cola, I believe in uh Mario and Luigi uh Superstar Saga, it was a laughing cola. You had to tell it jokes in order to make it good. You gotta be funny in order for your pop to be fizzy. Yeah. That's what made it all bubbly. So he's not going to give us the cola unless we give him something to trade for, and what do we trade for a Chocola Cola? Couple of coconuts. A coconut, there you go. Here's your coconut cola. Well, you see, Flavio, if you take both of those coconuts and you start knocking them together, eventually, they produce milk. This is what I learned on the internet. So now we gotta go all the way back and give the cola back to Bobbery! <laughs> keeping, <laughs> with the <clears throat> keeping with the theme of just, like, constantly in a hurry to tell Bobbery something, holding up this cola. Bobbery! <laughs> shake, 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 shake. <laughs> Here you go, Bobbery! Uh, twist, twist! <laughs> no! 
Here, quick, Bobbery, look it off my face. This is the only way you could drink the cola now, because I, I fucked it up. Uh, here you go. The only thing worse than dying is dying with flat soda. <laughs> Why is the Chocola Cola non humorous? Uh, because I let it listen to Dane Cook. I thought that would be good enough to make it laugh. Dane no? Cook? Wow! You, you, straight out of 2008 with that reference! But it was the only thing I could think of off the top of my head. <laughs> hey, listen to Carlos Mencia! Oh, I thought we were talking about flat, <laughs> flat coke, so... Actually, you with, know, if it's a Carlos Mencia cola, it just tastes like someone else's cola. It's familiar. Mmm, plagiarism. I, I wonder. Most unfunny comedian. Yudi J and the Discord. <laughs> oh my god, we're famous! <laughs> no! <laughs> we tried so hard! Damn it! Well, alright, at least we're known in the upper echelons as the most unfunny duo. <laughs> so, you know what? I'll take it. <laughs> that is a good question, though. Who is the most unfunny person? Well, see, I was just asking YouTube, because you know how everybody has, like, their, their clickbait uh, videos. Just, this guy's the most unfunny in the universe, so I'm, yeah. I'm just gonna ask YouTube. Uh, most... Uh, let me try this again. Most unfunny comedian... Oh, the, let's see. The autocomplete says, Most unfunny comedian, TikTok, funny comedian... Oh, most unfunny, funny comedian. What does that mean? <laughs> what you got, what you got there? Th that's probably us. <laughs> <laughs> let's see. Uh, Britain's Got Talent 2012 audition, UK version. Gaddis Candice is apparently yeah. the most unfunny, funny comedian, according to YouTube search results. Well, like, anti-comedy? Uh, uh, possibly. Like, you know, something that's not funny becomes funny again? It's like, maybe hey, it's like, like, hey, airline food, what's the deal with that? It's food uh, in the airline. Maybe it's just, like, delivered so dry that you can't help but laugh at it, like Stephen Fry? So we give Bobbery his mildly humorous, slightly shaken Chocola Cola. And now he passes away. Farewell, Bobbery. So tragic. Well, uh, looking ahead, we got a place we can heal. Very nice. And some, uh, strange-looking rocks. Hmm. That, that's for Waluigi, that's for Mario, and that's for... Is he still sleeping? Hey, yo, Bobber, you haven't passed on yet. I like how he turns to face me as he's sleeping. Huh. I think he's doing fine. Hey, Bobbery! <laughs> What, what? Pirates! Bobbery, did you know I said the name of the wrong person <laughs> about uh, two minutes ago? I was actually thinking of Stephen Wright. Shit. <laughs> I just really wanted some Chocola Cola. Bobbery is now reinvigorated now that he's alive again, so and he's ready to go. And check it out! Party member! Party member! Called it. Yeah! Yes! Woo! What is up, Bobbery? A little primer. You throw him, and he walks, and he goes boom! Well, he's a bomb! Dude. Dude. Yeah! He's still got some fight in him, I like this! Bobbery is a great party member. Like, well, top it, three like top three party members we have right now would be Goombella, Vivian, and Bobbery, in no particular order. Well, I think it's because everybody hates explosions. 
Well, sweet! Throw him, then he walks for a bit, and then kablam! Oh! I thought that was in battle. This is out in the open, too? Oh, yes. Neat! There's a bunch Wait. of cracks and stuff. Hidden doors oh, and the like. Oh, yeah! Stubborn well, that... walls that Flurry can't blow open, but Bobbery can blow open. Well, that kind of gave it away then, didn't it? What do you mean? Get him! Well, I mean, if you got cracked walls, well... Maybe Mario gets, like, a bomb power-up or something. Well, technically, he did. Or a, strong, or a strong enough hammer. Oh, maybe, yeah. So, uh, Bobbery's got a great attack. I want to see it. Show nice, me the... easy, simple to do, and does a <laughs> lot of does a lot of damage. Just uh... hold A, then kaboom. Holy crap. That is so good. Nope. His gas mixed. Good. I don't think I'd like to smell that. Mmm, smells like toxicity. I think we're gonna level up again at this rate. Awesome! We're, we're well overdue. I noticed in some of the earlier areas we, we weren't getting a lot overdue? of experience. We, we, we leveled up earlier! Uh, no, I mean for, like, catching up. Oh. Because those earlier areas, you were getting, like, crap for... Uh, for experience, and now you're getting a lot, so... Feels good. So those bombs will go off eventually. I don't think I placed them in the best positions. Uh, boom? Yeah, I'm waiting for it, too. Boom? That back one's gonna get wrecked. Oh. Yeah, he is. Alright, uh, Mario will do the hammer. Making that bomb useless. And then Bobbery will attack the middle one. So hopefully those uh, two back bombs there can take out that guy. Oh. Whenever they feel like going off, though. Okay, so Bomb there Squad is, is more like a... Oh, wait, that second one didn't count? I think it was just far enough away. Okay. Uh, it seems like Bomb Squad's more for, uh, you know, those long fights. Yeah. Boss encounters. Yeah! Ah. Ah. What is this, you know, an RPG or something? I was wondering why this video was, like, <laughs> six extra minutes after we got our new party member. It's all these fights getting back to the camp. And showing up Bobbery, of course. Oh, that's true. Oh, that that set's coming down. Ah! Aha. Man, they give, like, the biggest smooches on Mario. <laughs> can, can we count this as a kiss? Uh, no, because, uh, real kisses aren't supposed to hurt. Oh. I mean, if you do it right, you're not supposed to, you're not supposed to hurt. Ah. So let's go with HP this time, get everything up to 30. And if we level up again, we'll do badge points. There we go. Alright, so then the other fuzzy's coming. He's coming. He's coming, there He's coming. he is. Huh? I gotta end the episode. Get away from me! <laughs> Bobbery's like, what's that in my hair? In my mustache. Alright, I brought the guy. Oh, we were placing bets on whether he'd make it back or not. I just lost ten coins, damn it! Time to work as a team. Yeah, now is the time to work as a team. I growl at you. Allegro! You know, I never considered, because I just recently saw this scrolling through Twitter. There's like a huge art community for like secondary Mario characters. Like, of course there are, Flavio. because they don't get any love anywhere else. Yeah, like Flavio, Prince Peasley. They all have like 
massive art communities for characters that are, like, here for, like, a couple hours. Because they're very endearing characters, and everybody loves them, and then Nintendo sees what they're drawing, and they're very impressed, and then they see what else they're drawing, and they're like, okay, no more side characters ever. Only toads for you. Alright. Fair and square. Who thinks that he should come along with us to investigate the Skull Rock? Mm. Everybody raise your hands back at home. Anybody? Anybody? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. What's up, Flavio? We gotta bring Flavio back to those mysterious Skull Rocks we saw earlier. And, uh, we gotta go all the way back there again, but we'll do that next time, and let's play Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door! More intrigue and Skull Rocks and all that stuff. See you next time. <sighs> I'm so happy we got Bobbery as a teammate. Nope! Fuck that guy, though.